What are they gonna get here? I don't know. Ugh. Hey guys, we made it. Hey, so, uh, what are we doing here? <sighs> Did you not get the text message cup in? No. I don't have a phone. What's a phone? Whatever. Anyway, so, me and, uh, Fred and Foxy here invited you guys because we're going to the museum of things that God even can't explain. Wait, there's an actual museum called that? Yeah, it's just a bunch of weird stuff. Okay. Okay. So, what do you guys want to know? What do you, so, are we going? Well, we're right, right outside the building. Oh, yeah. So, you ready? Yeah. We're going on a... Oh, sorry. Foxy, I'll just drag your body. Oh, whatever. Come on, Cuphead. Okay. <sighs> Taurus today. I don't know why they're so late. I, I was scheduled one with a bear, a big fat bear, and... Hi! Welcome to the Museum of Things God Can Explain. Uh, thanks. Yeah, so, uh... I'm your tour guide, so... Uh, my, to be honest, this is my first day on the job, so I don't really know a whole lot. Okay, but what are you? I'm a frog, isn't that obvious? Yeah, but you're fuzzy. You know what? Shut your mouth. Okay, le le is it just you or is it someone else? Oh, there's like three more people back there. Wait, what? Why do I have to care for you guys? Ugh. Oh, goody. So, you guys may follow me. Because we're about to go on a journey. Um, okay, come on, guys. <laughs> My back. <laughs> My back can't take this stuff. Alright, we shall begin our tour going this way. Okay, come on, guys. <sighs> you know what? That's it. <laughs> you guys get out of each other. Foxy, we liked you carrying us. Well, I did it, okay? So if you could just pick up Jupa or let him crawl to us, I'm not picking you up, okay? Cuphead. What are we gonna do now? Uh, I guess we might as well just use our, use our legs. What? Our legs? I mean, how does these work? I lost my balance. Me too. Oh gosh, how do they work these things? Ah! <laughs> I got you. <laughs> we start our tour with this. Is that King Ghidorah? Yes, that is King Ghidorah. And fun fact, this is actually the costume that was used in the old Godzilla movies. Really? No. Because we don't have any budget to buy it from Toho. Because they say it's like, mmm, they'll think you guys own it. But we own it because we're Toho. We created Godzilla. I mean, they're right, so... Dang it, I really want that offer. Anyway, so yeah, this is just a prop that was used in the movie, not an actual suit. So, it's still from Toho. I don't know why they gave us a prop, but not a... You know what? Come on. Well, that's cool. We didn't get a good enough to look at it. What do you mean? It's three-headed dragon alien thing. That's understandable. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, whatever. I have touchy hands. Foxy, don't touch it! Fine. Next, we have this... Oh, it's not set up right. Yeah, there you go. Next, we have this giant... Oh! Stupid... There. We have this plax... This gigantic plastic axe. Plastic. Do you know what... This is not actually plastic. This is actually plastic. So, yeah. Whoa, this is cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but you see, fun fact about this, this was used in the last video. And Adrian thought it was a real axe. Why would we use a real axe? Answer that. Anyway, so yeah. Um, uh, you can touch this. I don't, I don't know what problems it will cause. Oh, it's a giant axe. I wonder which problems it's gonna cause. <sighs> Whatever. Hmm. It actually looks kind of like a real axe. It's actually kind of cool. Yeah, it's cool and cool. Did I say cool and cool? You don't learn how to speak. Shut up. Ooh, I get to touch this too. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, I'm gonna go back with my group. Why? E. Let's continue our tour. What was that? 
Oh, that is just a little miracle station. Yeah, we just bought it from jo Joey Drew Studios. What? Joey Drew Studios. I can't talk today. Anyways, um, yeah, so this is, uh, I don't know why there's ink all over the place. It's probably because of Bendy. Oop. Uh, n nothing. Oh, whatever. Anyways. <laughs> okay. There you go. That is a handprint by the ink demon himself. You just said you didn't, you didn't know who Bendy was. Well, I lied. You see, I'm a good liar. I am, I am taller than you. See, I lied, cause I'm very shorter than you. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm gonna move this back. So let's continue our tour. All right, and Foxy, don't do this segment where you touch it, okay? Cause that'll be obvious. Whatever. Touch. I forgot. Our legs are finally working. Really? Wait. W what's working? Our legs. What are legs? <sighs> Next, we have the walker crawler thing from Star Wars. Whoa, is this like a sculpture or something? No. It's actually a 3D model. But... It's actually kind of cool still. That's why I put it in here. Wow, the details on this thing is cool. Yeah, fun fact, you can actually buy this thing at Hobby Lobby. Yeah, it's uh, pretty interesting. Uh, I just bought it for $3.99. Just kidding, that's not how much it costs. But I just bought it and I just built it and then, boom, put it in here. Because why not? <laughs> that's cool. Wait, you, you gotta make sure Foxy doesn't touch it. Who? Foxy. My, the, my red friend over there, he keeps touching everything. Hey, what? He keeps touching everything? Yeah, like, I'm pretty sure he touched that axe. What axe? This one. Ah! Dude, that is expensive. You know what? Give me that axe. Give me that axe. <laughs> All right, what gives? All right, enough of that. If he stops touching things, then you guys can stay. But if he keeps touching freaking everything, then you guys are going to have to ask to leave. Okay? Fine. Foxy, don't touch anything. Can't say I won't. Foxy will leave if, we have, if you do that, if you keep touching. Wait, really? Yes, Foxy. So do you want to leave? No. Then I recommend you stop touching everything. Okay? Now let's go. What, are, what world are we in? We are in Super Smash Productions world. No crap, Sherlock. Wow. I'm pretty sure he meant to say no. Sh well, what's this area? Oh, this is just a bunch of drawings and stuff. Oh, cool. That looks like a mountain, and that looks like an anime freak. And that is apparently Shingojira. Why are there so many Godzilla stuff in here? There's only three. Three? Where's the third one? I don't know. Anyway, so, yeah, this is actually pretty cool. I like the mountain one. Yeah, it's pretty. <laughs> I'm gonna go steal from the bank today. I mean, not the bank. I mean, the museum. I messed up my own script. Crap. So, apparently, it's closed today. So, hopefully, with it being closed, I'll be able to go and steal some stuff. I'm gonna go check. <laughs> oh. No, it's packed. What am I gonna do? Where are you? Go back in the box, thick chick. Why did everyone say that? Whatever. Alright, so, hmm, how am I gonna do this? Oh, hey, hey, thick chick. What? You have me that, uh, toilet paper over there? It's you. Just give me it! Okay, jeez, whatever. Wait, this isn't toilet paper, this is just a piece of fabric. Oh, fine, this will be, this will be useful. I can use this as a mustache. <laughs> or just a mask. Wait, I just realized something. If it's corona season, then why is everyone not wearing masks? You know what? Cause we don't need masks. Okay? Cause this world, we this is this is not real. Okay? This is plushy, so none of this is real. I just broke the fourth wall. Again. <laughs> 
Alright, so if you don't mind, we're going to continue our tour. So, if Mr. Lion can get out of the way, we can look at this Beast Bendy drawing that your creator did. What? He drew that? That's awesome. Uh, hey, can we get a zoom in? Perfect. Can you back up a little? Okay. Just back up just a little. No, no, no. Why does this happen? Okay. Okay, I'll tell you when to stop. Uh, stop! Okay. It's good enough. So, yes, this is this is the Beast Bendy drawing you were talking about? Yes. Uh, if you want to see it, you should stand up. Well, I'm sorry. I don't stand up that well. Okay, shut up. Jump, jump! <sighs> Whatever. So, this is uh, Beast Bendy. Yeah, this is Beast Bendy. Fun fact, he actually got his jaw broke one time. Spoiler alert if you didn't see the last video. Yeah, Mace Bunny got his job broken. He's fine, though. He's just recovering at the hospital. The what? The nothing. Alright, we have two more things to look at, and then we'll get to our big boy. What's your big boy? Our big boy. Who's your big boy? My big boy. Who is your big boy? Our big boy. You know, our big boy. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, come on, guys. We didn't get a good look at the drawing, though. Is this all Sharpie? Nothing? No one's gonna say anything? I get it. No one cares about me anymore. Because no one cares. Oh, so sad. Everyone likes our game better than yours. <laughs> I'm surprised Foxy didn't touch it. Touch. Uh, Alright, hey Foxy, get out of the way. Okay. So this is our last exhibit. This is... Well, actually, this is our last exhibit. Excuse my stupid language. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, we're almost done. But this is just a, a 50-year-old bear who's missing a couple of brain cells. Whatever. Hey, then. Here's one. Hey. You know what I'm not going to say? Because then Foxy's going to do it. You want me to touch it, don't you? No. Okay, let's go. I'm out of here. Woo! <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Fazbear. <laughs> okay, now we have our final exhibit. Now, these aren't going to be here for long, so you guys are lucky that you get to see these. These are the animatronics that are going to be sold to the brand new Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Place in the mall. So, basically, before that opens, we just thought we'd show you the animatronics before they uh, go and in, in the thing. You know, why are they all scrunched up in a box? <sighs> Budget reasons. Anyway, so yeah, that, that that's the animatronics. I kind of simp for the chicken. What? Anyways, let's take you to our big boy now. The what? Our big boy. What? Our big boy. What? Our big boy. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's go. Must not touch, because if I touch, we'll leave. <sighs> I can't touch the- I can't touch Chica, I can't touch Monty, I can't touch anyone. <sighs> but I will smack her into the box. Oh gosh, I gotta put this back. Okay, we're good. I'm just gonna go. Now, we shall take you to our- what? Wait, hang on, I'm getting, I'm getting a call on my invisible phone. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. There's a break-in! Ew! Wait, what? Freddy, there's a break-in? Uh, I guess they're talking about, like, someone broke into the museum. The mu Did you say museum? Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so shut up. You know, that should be entertaining if you watch. Okay. Where is he? Hello? Oh, thank goodness you're here. Um, uh, What? I don't know. Um, listen, uh, someone broke in and now they're stealing a piece of painting. Why aren't you doing anything about it? Look at me. I'm overweight. Oh, I see that. Well, and you're fast, okay? So are bunnies. We both hop. We should know how to do this stuff. <sighs> Whatever. Anyways, uh, but wait, there he is! Ugh. Jeez Louise. I cannot 
pull this. Ugh. Oh, I'm getting too off with this crap. Oh. Invasive annulers! Oh, get him! Oh. Ah, no! Oh. oh, goody, there's a hat right here. All right, there, Sheriff. I mean, dude, you have the right to remain silent. Why do you have to talk like that when you're wearing the hat? I just thought it looked cool. Okay, it doesn't matter. Stupid tissue. All right, so yeah, you're coming with us. All right, to the slammer. Oh, at least it's just jail. Oh, by slammer we mean like you're, we're gonna smash your head with a hammer. What? No! What just happened? All right, so uh, Spring Bonnie, you take him to the, uh, you know, the place. Gotcha. Okay, uh, before we continue, I gotta sneeze. Hey. Hey. <coughs> Thank you. Anyways, um, yeah, so now that that's out of the way, we can continue the rest of the tour. Okay, let me hop over you. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, and this is our big boy. She is beautiful, but don't touch it. No, you cannot touch it because it is dangerous to touch it because whoever touches it, they will be possessed by something we don't even know what. Wait, so what does it do? Oh, I don't know. Well, it just possesses you if you touch it. Wait, where'd you find this? Oh, some old geezer dug it out of a mine shaft, so. And he just sold it to us because he thought, mm, might be a good attraction at the museum. <laughs> um, okay. But, like, what is it called? Uh, well, on the markings of the wall where it was dug up, it was it just said Dread Bear. So we just decided to call it that. Oh, that's weird. Dread Bear out of all things, huh? Yeah, it's a weird name. Alright, whatever. I'm just going to go wave at the door since our museum trip is over. Huh, this thing actually looks kind of cool. It's like an actual crystal. Wait, it is. Oh. Wow, that's actually very cool, Foxy. Foxy, you're in the way. Oh, That's very cool. Yeah, so I'm going to go. I'm just going to go get another group. So thank you guys for coming. Woo. That's cool. All right, Foxy. If you want to start it some more, we're just going to go right by the door. But don't touch it. This is one you really can't touch, okay? <sighs> Fine, Freddy. But why can't I touch it? I mean, he's not around, so. Okay, I'm going to the door. <laughs>